all the courses that were presented to the National Universities Commission were fully accredited. Obviously, it's in the academic uh, briefs to the NUC, there are a few more courses that we have not yet presented, but they are in the academic brief. Because when you do the academic brief, you saw that they are putting it in different years. They start off courses. The courses you are able to start off in the second year and possibly in the third year and even as you progress on. The courses we presented for the first year have all been accredited. There was no one denied. And um, they are already in the process of admission because they gave us letters to, uh, uh, to Jan. I'm told that at the moment they, they've gotten quite a reasonable number of students, about 500 already uh, offered admission and they are expecting a little more. So there's no doubt that the university is going to be, uh, it's a place that a lot of persons want to come into. You know? I'm quite satisfied with the level of uh, work done in the various projects. So you where we started from the administrative block, which has gone very far, and the contractor has promised to deliver that uh, in March. And the way with the progress of work, obviously, to be delivered in March. And then we went to the VC's lodge, which has also we just started three and a half uh, months ago. And uh, we have a finish date of March also of this year. And I think that with the work done, that's quite fast. It's very achievable. From there, we went to the Faculty of Environmental Sciences. Uh, that one is already near completion. And uh, we're told that by the middle of February, they will be true with that project. But I do believe that um, I'm giving them an extension to the end of February. Uh, apparently the work there, the work done the, uh, <clears throat> the finished stage, I'm sure that uh, you saw it along with me, it's something very satisfactory and I'm happy. I must commend all the contractors. We also saw the road project that is ongoing that takes us very quickly into the Faculty of Environmental Sciences, unlike the road we took the last time we went to see that project. But the biggest of the project, is, our staff project, is the Faculty of Agricultural Sciences. Um, it's a huge project. 
uh, the contractor has told us he uh, should finish by December, but we've told him uh, to try to um, find ways of getting to finish by end of September, October. You uh, can see that one, that is really a very huge building with uh, a 500 seat auditorium and two 250 seat auditorium, along with the main uh, faculty building. And uh, we do believe that by the time they've completed that, um, yeah, there'll be a lot of space. Uh, we call it Faculty of Agricultural Sciences, but I'm sure that it's going to take more than, it's quite a huge building to take more than the Greek Science Faculty. I also went to see the new gate, uh, the new gate, the entrance gate, and that is nearing completion also. Here we are uh, inspecting office, extra office blocks that has been put up by government. I think uh, I, I like what I see, and I'm sure that you like what you see too. Uh, it's, uh, I just looked on the inside. Uh, things are put on the ground. You are not able to appreciate it in full. And from what I see, there's a lot in here. Beautiful space, beautiful work environment. At, at the time they complete. And I've just asked the contractor, and he believes it should be true here at the end of uh, when? March? March. 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 Yes. And then you're also aware that we're building new quarters for the SSG and the, and the chief of staff. Yeah, I looked at it. Uh, it's, I hope I, it's competing very favorably with my. <laughs> it's a good one, and yeah. the contractor is doing very well. Good finishing mm. they were seen, and I, I think that is good. It's a good one, and yeah. the contractor is doing very well. Good finishing mm. they were seen, and I, I think that is good. Yeah, at, at least uh, very different from what we had before. Mm. The office of the SSD and chief of staff, at least uh, the, where they live, it also matters. Mm. So I believe that by the time they pack in here, their colleagues will respect them a little more.